Doctors say a new method to treat glaucoma is safer and much faster than the previous treatment. News for Jacks reporter Aaron Farrar explains how a Jacksonville doctor was one of the first in the area to use the tool that might prevent a woman from going completely blind. Critical eye appointments and treatment are more than routine for Marion Rogers now. A glaucoma diagnosis, diabetes, and a brain tumor played roles in her losing more than just the vision in her right eye. For me, the loss of total control of my life, like is going shopping by myself or driving anytime I want to. You did all right? I'm good. After failed eye procedures, she finally got a promising treatment that may ultimately save her left eye. Ophthalmologist Rajesh Shetty with Florida Eye Specialist used this Zen Gel stint that he believes will make a difference. It's a new device that has helped us reduce eye pressure without causing, uh, without having to do a larger procedure with a lot less uh, trauma to the eye and a lot less complications. Glaucoma is an eye disease that causes damage to the optic nerve that connects the eye to the brain. It often goes undiagnosed until it causes vision loss, like in Rogers' case. What I'm trying to maintain now is the right, the left eye being able to function and I'm able to do certain things without help. So that's my goal. We're fortunate to have this device that we can offer her to reduce her eye pressure and save her eye um, while she's being treated for multiple different conditions. Now, Rogers hopes the stent will help her brother too if he ends up needing immediate treatment. Now, he's sort of seeing and he's telling me, oh, my eyes are blurry. I, sometimes I, it, it gets black, you know, when he's trying to see or... Do something. Roger says quick action can help her brother from going down a familiar road. It makes me feel good that I can help him and that he may be able to not go through all the loss that I have. She says that would be a win. Aaron Farrar, Channel 4, the local station. Glaucoma typically occurs in people who are over 40 and the risk increases exponentially for those over 60. Doctor, the doctor says those at higher risk are African Americans and Hispanics.